Barnes. In just two minutes and 19 seconds before they scored here. The pitch out to Henderson. Henderson finding some where Chun is backed in. Flanked to the left of Silvers. He gets the ball. Rather, it's a fake. And Tavares McCormick and a bunch of wins. 12 to be exact. Behind. He's coming off a terrific junior campaign as he gets the carry once more at a 48. Nice pace here to the offense. And right there on target. To be made. Going one way and then come back another way. His body language and his eyes have a lot to do with his completion percentage. Quick release out to the left again. If you want to go and uh, get quick score. And that name might be familiar to you. We was on last chance you out of East. Alabama comes up with another grab. The handoff to the right side. There's Chun trying to find some room. The nothing advantage. Once more, and the DB makes a shoestring third and five. And picked off, and this one could be taken to the house. The route jump by Ronnie Scott, showing off his speed. To tie it all at seven, we'll see what they do from the 32-yard line. The handoff to Henderson. Henderson finds some room. He gets, he gains uh, six on that last play in good field position. They switch things up and go back to. Guy who started as a true freshman, a rarity, and he leads that offensive line for the Trojans. Be a screen. We'll see if that plays into this play at all. Play action pass. Silver has thought about going deep, has to get rid of it as he's pressuring. And T will see what happens after the snap. Looks to the left, finds his man. One, they were one of one last week. And here they give it to big number 38, George. Pressure, it's paying dividends right now. They've got to take it down the field. Oh, and he's got the arm strength and the receivers to, to get success out of that. Rolling to the right side, finds Thompson. Just under 15 ticks to go in this first quarter. The handoff to Anderson and Anderson finding good game here for you as the Troy Trojans moving in on offense trying to pick up another five for ASU but as the Hornets learned last week it doesn't matter if you lead the statistical category <laughs> excellent job of spreading the ball around that's the seven different receiver he's found and this one tipped up in the air ever so dangerous Silvers looking and right there. So far, the Trojans have been able to minimize these third and long situations. Silvers has all kinds of time and right in as they begin this drive from inside the 20 yard line. Nice slant route over to Tavares McCormick. McCormick gets free, and this guy has breakaway ability. He sheds several tacklers. He keeps going, rumbling all the way down. In Tackle, shift out of another one, and great, great. Uh, play there on that previous play. Mitts, very reliable hands for a first down. And you see the tempo that the Trojans are electing to run. Still on his feet, Jordan Chuck. Trojans a lead. The two-point conversion trying to catch the Hornets. Off. In the first half, and Silvers takes the snap out of the shotgun. Deep. Finds a... They're in, inside of Hornet territory, right inside the 50-yard line. Another quick pass out to short gain. Call it second and five. Number 33. Big Alabama State's only score of the game. They're under three minutes to go at the 30 yard line. And Chun. Protection that time applied by the. Troy offensive lineman. Now he finds four. Silvers slings it over. Room they already have a six point advantage as Brandon Silvers hands it off, finds the speedster on the court. Let's dial up. Silvers has had his way. Pressure applied by the Hornets defense. 
We see if he picks up, we, which he did not. And Silvers started 8 of 8 for that game, and then you just mentioned he was 10 of 10 before that last pass here, connected once more with Jordan Chun, and he just shakes off a defense. Up at the 36-yard line, a completion of 16. The handoff to Henderson. Henderson along that left side. Receiver, you got to block as well. It's not all about catching the ball. And Henderson has had a pretty decent night. Five carries, 46 yards, and here. It's between a wide receiver and a basketball player, as you well know, and, and that certainly makes Thompson something special. John Johnson on the quick F from the Trojans. And after that incompletion, Silvers is gashing this Alabama, the reception, but certainly uh, it impeded the defensive back's ability to come up. And coming from that backside, applying some pressure. Zach back McGee. Chun with the reception. We've seen him. Silvers with time. And just dropped by Sam to go. So another red zone opportunity for the Trojans. The handoff to Chun and nobody is there. And a penalty flag. 25 yards still in very good field position. The handoff once again to Jordan Chun and Chun. Kirk Kelly with a nice seal block allowing Chun to get wide. Then you have the speed on the other side from him. 58 yards and two TDs. Henderson added the other and Chun says I want more but wow what a second down There's Silvers. Silvers finds his man. Zone and inside the five yard line. Now to the three. Quick snap and in best offense in the Sun Belt a season ago they're looking to do the same here in a nice thread of the needle from went to his third or fourth option that time and Silvers kind of went through his progressions got one more playoff before the end of the third quarter thousand six penalty marker on the field as a reception from Set up nicely as Chun. I of the whole Hornets. Silvers with 323 passing, trying to add to it, does so. Chun once again, one of his favorite percent grade, which is pretty high. And the handoff to Henderson. Henderson still on his feet, and finally, as he was run individual effort, first down for the Trojans. Once again on the right side here in Rashad Dillard, a ton in practice last year. Just before that one closed out the season, losses to Arkansas State and Georgia Southern took away their chances of special year. Well, good news for their offense. They returned just about 99% of that production from a season ago in Silvers, Decatur, Alabama, 6-1, 2 10. And on the first play in completion. And there he likes to do it with his feet, and that one almost. And then Letton, Letton being dragged and moves forward. Big grabs this evening, and that was a big one, giving him a first down. Here's Barker once it off, same offense. And Henderson, Henderson says you're not gonna get me down there to now giving the, the opponent possession and keep a drive alive on a penalty otherwise and this one is barker barker potential of this team and and the leadership you got a lot of people coming back and as you mentioned a little while ago the all-conference players that did return jerseys clean most of the evening This Troy offense has racked up better than 600 yards of total offense and Barker with his fifth.